If you like the channel, do subscribe. Hello and welcome to another unboxing slash show and tell. Um, this time it's about a, a conflict that I uh, really don't know too much about, except of uh, I remember the main and uh, maybe a couple of other superficial information about that but um, uh, it is a, a learning occasion for me uh, to even to unbox the game but to play the game etc this is part of my uh, uh, my birthday haul um, and uh, I'm very much uh, psyched about um, trying it out. Um, really like naval games, even if this is a, a strategic one. But um, yeah, I'll uh, see what's what. So, Dawn of Empire, the Spanish American Atlantic Naval War, 1898 Compass game. Very nice artwork on the cover. Um, with the uh, pre-dreadnought battleship on it. Uh, two pairs of dice, black and white, those are nice. Um, and the rule book, um, a bit glossy, but uh, not very bothersome for me, uh, at least. Um, yeah, it's full color, uh, not very many, oh, here, here there, are, there are a few illustrations, bunch of text, I have no, no issue with that, um, yeah, we have some, uh, we have a detailed example of play here. is nice 20 pages and then we have the uh, this is a sort of a battle display because we have a non-initiative player battle line initiative player battle line so we have the battle lines here with uh, destroy units and disable units so this is uh, perhaps the uh, um, the area in which the battles are resolved on a tactical level we have an abbreviated sequence of play good good card stock in um, two copies <coughs> <clears throat> Sorry. Then we have counters, which are beautiful. Uh, thick cardboard. Uh, so these are the uh, American, the US counters. They are rounded, so uh, less time spent clipping counters and more time spent actually playing with them. Uh, really like the silhouettes for the for the ships. Double sided. The ones for the ship are uh, have one side, so maybe some fog of war elements there. Maybe who knows? I don't know. And then we have the map slash game board which is mounted and uh, oh, there is a bit of a problem if you are not too careful because uh, you see that you can you can uh, peel the map off but I'll be careful uh, but other than that, really thick 
cardboard with a nice not very complicated it looks rather simple and effective map of the of the uh, area the Caribbean especially so we have the United States Mexico over there or there Central America and a bit of South America over here and uh, the center of it all Cuba and the uh, uh, Haiti Dominican Republic and Puerto Rico with some zones we have a search metric chart metrics chart over there with a victory point chart uh, with victory sorry victory point track above and a turn track right on top so yeah nice good sturdy uh, map of the area with um, the uh, counter anatomy and other stuff on the map so yeah it's um, an interesting uh, subject uh, a very good opportunity for me to learn some more stuff and maybe open up some uh, uh, interest in this solitary suitability is 5 out of 10 so it's uh, medium but uh, that shouldn't pose a problem uh, number of players too average time to play 2 to 3 hours of course for me it will be much longer complexity is 4 out of 10 so not too complex um, so yeah um, interesting subject looking forward to playing it um, so yeah uh, this is uh, about it for uh, this game um, for now at least thank you for watching goodbye